Hi, I'm Rachel from Maison de Pax, and today I'm going to show you how to paint the outside of an acrylic clawfoot tub. We purchased a little Texas ranch house several years ago, but it was in need of a lot of work. Fortunately, the existing attic provided a lot of extra square footage we needed, so we decided to build that out, adding a bedroom, family room, and this bathroom. I had visions of a black clawfoot tub tucked into the nook under the eaves in the converted attic bathroom, but budget was running low by that point, and the only black tub I could find was $500 more than the white one. So I began experimenting. I started by testing my idea on the back side of the tub, the one that would forever be hidden against the wall in the space, and it worked. So as you can tell, I repeated the steps on the rest of the tub, and I give you what you see today. Let me show you how. First, remove the legs and other hardware. Second, give the outside of the tub a light sanding, removing the sheen of the tub's finish. You want a nice matte surface for the paint to adhere. Third, clean the tub with damp paper towels. It's super important to get all the sanding dust off so your paint can adhere well. Fourth, be sure that your drain holes and the lip of the tub are completely taped off and protected with plastic to avoid any overspray. Fifth, Spray a primer made for plastic in a light, even coat over the tub. Six, once the primer has dried, according to the package instructions, use a water-resistant paint. I used an exterior paint in satin because I already had it and knew I loved the color. Plus, what's better for standing up to moist environments than a paint that's made to be rained on? Apply your paint as smoothly as possible, avoiding brush strokes if you can. I opted for a trim roller, which still wasn't perfect, but it was better than the brush. Another light sanding and cleaning between coats can help to give a smoother finish. If a totally smooth finish is important to you, you might want to consider spraying it rather than rolling. Let your paint dry completely. Return the feet and other hardware, install the tub, and enjoy. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. For more DIY projects, decorating ideas, and design inspiration, subscribe or visit MaisonDePax.com.